Here's a standard problem within Excel. I want to build a formula that calculates my price times a tax rate multiplier. I want my tax rate multiplier to be in a single cell. So I'll build my initial formula equal my price asterisk my type tax rate multiplier. Now all I'm going to do is copy my formula down and it doesn't work. Well what went wrong? If I double click on one of my formula cells here, I'll see that what happened was as it copied my formula, it also kept copied the same relative cell position. And consequently, it ended up looking at these empty cells for the tax rate multiplier. So the solution to that then is to go back and modify my original formula with what's called an absolute cell reference. So I'm going to double click on my B3 to select it. I'm going to press the F4 function key, which will put dollar signs indicating the absolute cell reference in front of that particular cell reference. And I'll enter that. And now I'll recopy it. And now it works for all of the cells. And you can see that if I double click on this last formula here, you can see that it references the price and the same tax rate multiplier. So if I now go back and change my tax rate multiplier, 1.08, for instance, and enter that, then it updates all of the relative cells.